Hello future rankers. So today in this video we are going to solve first PYQ from chemistry of chapter atomic structures for ESET 2026. Come on, let's do this. So the question here is the valence electronic configuration of prosperous atom atomic number is 15. So first let us understand what this question is actually asking us about. So come on, let's do this. So this question, this word we have to first understand valence electronic configuration we know configuration we know valence together what it is i'm going to explain it now valence means the outermost shell outermost or highest energy level electronic configuration means arrangement of an electrons in an subshells or orbitals together when we consider this word it simply means it is asking us to write the electronic configuration for the outermost shell or highest energy level so, first let us write the full configuration, then uh, choose the part what they are asking in a question. Come on, let us do this. So, the atomic number is 15. Atomic number tells us how many electrons and protons are there in, for that atom. So, there are 15 electrons in that prosperous atom. So, let us write the configuration in a way so that each orbital together holds 15 electrons. Come on. 1, S2, 2, S2. 2p6. Let us check. Did it cover 15 or not? So, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So, more phi are there. Let us go to another energy level which is 3. So, 3s2, 3 12, 15. More 3 are there. Come on, let us use one more orbital which is 3p. It can hold 6 but as per our question, we need to cover 15. Already 12 are done. So, 3 are left. So, we are going to consider it as 3. This is the full electronic configuration. They are asking us only the valence, means highest energy level. In this, this part is the highest energy level. So, we got the answer. Come on, let's just use the options. First option, yes, it is. But wait a second. Second, third, fourth also we will check. Second one, no. Because D, it is not only used. Because P orbital still more 3 electrons capacity is left. So, we can't go for D. And it should be 6. It should be 2 if we really want to go for D. So, no, this is also no. This is also not that option. So, this one is the correct option. Happily go with it. So, this is how we have to solve when they ask valent electronic configuration. In further videos, if I mention any method, understand I am talking about molar diagram or diagonal rule. I am going to explain how I wrote this configuration within few seconds. In one long video, I am going to do it. Check it out, okay? Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for more tips and tricks to make your ESET preparation faster and smarter.